on a double date in London with twin boys that we just met today. Stick around till the end because they're going to tell us what they thought of the date and we will also tell you guys how we think it went. Also, if you're wondering why we're going on this double date, make sure you watch last week's video and you'll understand why. Okay guys, we're getting ready for the double date tonight with Sam and Tegan. Are you nervous? Not too bad. To be fair, it's our first double date. First so. double date, yes. Looking forward to it. This is the kind of vibe we've gone with. It's really cold. I'm deciding my outfit, so not too sure which one. Go this one, Joe. You think? Yeah, let's go. So this is the outfit I'm gonna wear tonight. Got the off whites with the brown hoodie, the jacket, and then some jewelry here. Looks good. All sorted. Ready? Yeah, we're ready. Walking to the London Eye. Got the transport on the scooters. <laughs> so the boys are waiting for us and they just sent us a photo where they are. Loving the outfits. Thank you so much. You guys actually told us to go to the London Eye, so there it is. We couldn't get tickets, so we're just scootering in front of it. <laughs> Dan and Tegan, let's see your skills. Yeah, you start feeling off. Yeah, that's probably <laughs> best. Now that we're really confident, we're actually going to trek it to Big Ben <laughs> on the scooter. Spotlight here. There he is. He's beautiful. We still don't know why Big Bird is famous. <laughs> you guys know? You're Scottish, you don't know either. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no, he didn't. Crazy, crazy. <laughs> Too fast for my life. <laughs> he's out. He's gone. Tegan does drive all the time. Yes, I, I drive all the time as well, actually. We like to be in control. Yeah. We're the bossy ones. Right. Yes. Uh -huh. that's the is that one. how it is? Yep, I'd say so. We're going to go go karting. And of course, because we lost the gymnastics challenge, we have to pay for Sam and Joe. Of course, it's okay. We'll have a good time. <laughs> we will. Let's <laughs> pay. <laughs> Guys, our go-kart is broken. We just keep losing power. Like four times. Oh. Um, I think we need a refund. Shall we join you now? They just won something, so I know I know these guys can do it. I'm close for you. Okay. Pooh Bear or Eeyore? Either one. Alright, Dan, you're up. Tegan really wants a Tigger. We're trying to get a hole in one. Yes, Dan. Get that bag. Oh, nice. Ten years later. <laughs> hole in one. Looks good. Oh, oh my God. Dan just got a hole in one. <laughs> that was really good. Well done. Well done, Harry. Well done, Harry. <laughs> <laughs>
Dude, that wasn't cheap. These guys are honestly trying so hard. So like, we're gonna have to cut your jacket, and then some maintenance guy came. A few moments later. Oh my god. Currently attempting to make a reservation at a fancy restaurant. Oh goodness. <laughs> They're not answering. It says 24 hours. <laughs> That's the field date paid for. Look at this. Fancy meal. Wow. Double date was a success. It was. Yes. I know that. Thank you very much. Comment below if you think the floating <laughs> should come to Australia. I think we should comment I yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> They've already decided. Guys, smash that like button. 50,000 and the Flow Twins will meet us in Perth, Australia. Let's do it. All right, so we're back in Scotland. Let's do a quick debrief on that double date. So enjoyable though, wasn't it? It just, it seems so natural, eh? I think it was because we were both twins and we yeah. had so much in common. I naturally gravitated towards Stig and the older one, <laughs> and I'm the older one, and you naturally gravitated towards Sam. The older twins had the same traits. Yeah. And the younger twins had the same traits as well. Being twins and, and trying to go on dates and relationships, it is different because we're so close as twins. And it was really nice to see how much we had in common. Yeah. No, really fun day in London. Yeah, e-scooters was a was a highlight, I think. Tegan's maniac driving. <laughs> R.I.P. Oh, Tam's jacket. R.I.P. Oh. It was low-key funny, but I, was, I felt kind of bad. Yeah. I felt kind of bad. I wish we had more time to take them out to like a fancy restaurant, but there's always the next time for that. Definitely. I'm sure we will be in Australia at some point. Hopefully we can spend more time together and do a lot more fun activities and create good content for you guys. Our first double date was definitely a success, yes. I would say. Hopefully Sam and Tegan enjoyed it as much as we did. How did it go? <laughs> it went really good. I loved experiencing a double date. It's the first time we've ever done that. So it was pretty cool. I feel like we could be really relaxed and I feel like they felt the same. Yeah. Because dates can be you scary. Tense off and like, yeah. So it was nice that we could all just enjoy it. As you guys saw, we ended up having dinner at Macca's. Like by the time we had dinner, it was midnight. There wasn't many options, but to be it was honest, still really good. As long as you've got good company, it's a good time. Kind of didn't really want the night to end, and I guess that's like a good thing because yeah, there's nothing worse so than fun. like being on a date and being like, "Is this over yet?" I know. <laughs> I've been on a few dates. And I'm like, <laughs> but so no, no, it was, it was really so much good. Fun. Yeah, and it just felt really chill. There was no pressure. We had a little problem at the end with Sam's jacket, but that didn't ruin the night. No, it did. It just kind of paused it for a sec. Also, the boys brought us a gift, which we thought was the cutest thing ever. Do you guys want to see what they got us? So they got us these purple sparkly. So Starbucks cups. They also got us these some cute Nike socks. socks. We wear Nike socks all the time. And we got this cute lip, lip balm. balm. Like they didn't have to do that, but they did. So it just, it was just the it's so nice. thing. So yeah, shout out to Joe and Dan. They seriously were the nicest guys. Yeah, such gentlemen. They even opened our door for us. I know. That, that was, was so really, sweet. We had to take off our heels to get on the go-kart. And they were literally like helping us. That was just really cute as well. So yeah, we had a the really best good date time. I've been on. <laughs> it was really good. So yeah, 10 out of 10. Okay, bye.